Hello, I'm Jovan Johnson. The Jamaica Civil Service Association says normalcy cannot be guaranteed in the public sector if the government does not urgently move to address outstanding salary issues associated with the new compensation scheme. The association says the vast majority of its 30,000 members are currently restive. And Information Minister Robert Morgan has taken the opposition People's National Party to task for coming out against the massive salary increases for parliamentarians. On Wednesday, Mr. Morgan noted that the opposition spokesman on finance, Julian Robinson, initially said he was fine with the increases. And then, today, his party issued a strong objection in an apparent about turn. The Caribbean Examinations Council CXC says it is investigating reports that the Caribbean Secondary Education Certificate CSEC Math Paper 2, which was written today, was leaked. In a release to the media on Wednesday afternoon, CXC said the matter was of great concern and it would make a definitive statement once the investigation is completed. Turmoil is brewing in another People's National Party PNP selection process as councillors in Western Westmoreland have indicated they are against the inclusion of Ian Hales as an aspirant to represent the party in the seat. In sports, Bernardo Silva scored twice as Manchester City advanced to the Champions League football final with a 4-0 win against Real Madrid on Wednesday. City will play Inter Milan in Istanbul on June 10. In your currency trading, at midday today, one US dollar was being sold for $155.48, the British pound sterling for $197.67, and the Canadian dollar for $117.66. In your weather forecast, on Thursday morning, there will be partly cloudy skies. In the afternoon, expect widely scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms across northern parishes and hilly areas. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. Remember to follow us on Twitter, Facebook and Instagram, and like, comment and share on YouTube. I'm Jovan Johnson.